Well, thousands of East Tennessee students are going on day four of no school. A lot goes into the decision to cancel. Olivia Daig joining us to explain why. Olivia. John Robin, I've been monitoring school closures all day and speaking to school leaders on what factors they're looking at when they make these decisions. This is a look at Bell Morris Elementary in Knoxville. Now these kids would be pretty cold and wet after playing on this playground. I went to a few schools in Knoxville. There were no sidewalks, driveways or parking lots salted. It was very slippery and covered in ice with inches of snow on top. And most schools called it mid-afternoon or just before noon. Knox County Schools waited until a little after 2.30 to tell parents. Superintendent Dr. John Reisewick explains why they wanted to make the decision. Um, I had talked with other area superintendents and, you know, our whole team had been on calls and monitoring National Weather Service. So I really was uh, curious on what was going to happen or what they were projecting into the Thursday night to Friday. He also said they're looking at road conditions. Now, Dr. Ricewick says the school district is using five of their eight snow days, but they have two virtual days to use as well. Now, there's also questions about child care and school lunches since many students and families rely on the school district for those services. The superintendent says they aren't offering child care options for families, but local partners like the United Way and religious organizations can help with meals. John, Robin. All right, Olivia Digg on the update. Thank you.